Hi friends, welcome to today's class. Today's question is, A and B together can do a piece of work in 12 days and B and C finish the same work together in 16 days. After A has worked on it for 5 days and B for 7 days, C finishes the work in 13 days. In how many days will C alone be able to finish the work? So what's the question given? A and B together can finish a piece of work in 12 days and B and C together can finish the same work in 16 days and A is working for 5 days and after that A is leaving then B is coming and B is working for 7 days and after that C is coming and C is finishing the work in 13 days. So A will be working for 5 days, B will be working for 7 days and C will be working for 13 days and all together the work will be finished. So in how many days C will be able to finish the work alone? So that's the question given. So here also let's use the chocolate approach. So the amount of work to be finished is equal to the number of chocolates. The number of chocolates should be equal to the LCM of 12 and 16 that is 48. So the meaning is the A will be working for 5 days, B will be working for 7 days and C will be working for 13 days in order to finish 48 chocolates. Then if C is working alone, how much time will it take? This is a peculiar kind of question. So here we have the information that A plus B or A and B together is taking 12 days to complete and B and C together is taking 16 days to complete. So we know that in order to solve 3 variables, we need to have 3 equations. But here we are having only two equations and we are having three variables A, B and C. So we cannot solve the equations and find out how many days are taken by A or how many days are taken by B or how many days are taken by C to finish the work. So we have to do another approach here. Here it is given A is working for 5 days, B is working for 7 days and C is working for 13 days. So how can this be written in the form of A plus B and B plus C. So A is working for 5 days and B is working for 7 days. So here we can write it as A plus B is working for 5 days and then B is working for 2 days. So that way we can split and write. Okay. And here it is given B is working for remaining 2 days is there. So B is working for 2 days and C is working for 13 days. So that we can split and write. B plus C is working for 2 days and then C is working for 11 days. So altogether this can be split, split and be written as A plus B's 5 day work plus B plus C's 2 days work plus C's 11 day work is equal to 48. 48 is the total number of chocolates. So we are writing like this because we are only having A plus B and B plus C. So we are required to write this in the form of this equation. Now we want to find out what is A plus B's one day work and what is B plus C's one day work. So A plus B is completing the work in 12 days. Here it is given A plus B is completing the work in 12 days and the total number of chocolates is 48. Therefore A plus B will be having 48 by 12 is equal to 4 chocolates per day and B plus C, B and C together are completing the work in 16 days. So they are completing the work that is they are completing 48 chocolates in 16 days. So B plus C will be having 48 by 16 is equal to 3 chocolates per day. So now we can complete this equation. So A plus B is 5 day work. So A plus B is having 4 chocolates per day. A and B together are having 4 chocolates per day. So A plus B's 5 day work will be equal to 4 into 5. So we are substituting A plus B is 1 day work is 4 chocolates per day. So within 5 days they will be having 4 into 5. And B plus C will be having 3 chocolates per day. So within 2 days they will be having 3 into 2. Plus we don't know what is C. C how many chocolates C are having 1 day we don't know. So C into 11 is equal to 48. C is representing the number of chocolates taken by C in 1 day. So we will be getting 20 plus 6 plus 11 C is equal to 48. So we will be getting 26 plus 11 C is equal to 48 or 11 C is equal to 48 minus 26 is equal to 22. That means C is equal to 2. 
So she will be having two chocolates per day. So what is our question? Our question is we have to find out if she is working alone, how many days will it take for the completion? The total number of chocolates is 48. So number of days she will be taking will be given as 48 chocolates is the total amount of work and we will be having she will be having two chocolates per day so 48 divided by 2 is equal to 24 days so if you want to see another example of the same kind please watch the next video thank you for watching